Hello, class. Can you guys Thank hear you, me? Give me a moment. Yes. My computer isn't cooperating with me and I can't hear you. Just give me a moment. Hi, can you hear me now? Hello? Yes, teacher. Good oh, evening, teacher. Wonderful. All right. Excellent. Uh, how are you guys? Good evening. Good evening. Hi. Hi, welcome. How are you? Thank you. I'm great <laughs> in my case. What about you, teacher? Good. Not, not, not bad at all. Um, okay. Yeah, how 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 was your day today? Oh, it was awful. <laughs> really? Why? Yeah, because it was raining, and I I I woke up lately. <laughs> very oh. very. Late. Yeah. yeah, it's nice when it's raining to sleep, right? Mm hmm. Perfect. And I was at my, I, I usually go to my job exactly 6 a.m. And I was in the, in the bus stop, uh -huh, a.m. Uh -huh. wow. And I was in the bus stop around 8 a.m. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> One hour later. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's two hours later. Yeah. Two hours. <laughs> Two hours exactly. Oh my goodness! What happened? What what did, you, what did your boss say? I uh, she didn't tell me uh, something awful, but she she was very mm, like mm. <laughs> we got mm, good morning. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. That happened. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. I, I, it's, I, I like that weather. For me, I like that weather. Um, I like it when, it when it's raining in the morning. I like it a lot. But, um, but yes, it, it makes you want to stay in bed a little bit more. That's, that's the only problem. <laughs> oh, no. Exactly. Um, all right, chicos, um, quería, bueno, para antes que empecemos, quería mencionarles algo. El día de hoy que estaba pasando las notas, noté que hay muchos de ustedes que no han hecho el midterm. Y otros de ustedes no han terminado la unidad 2. Entonces, um, como eran varios, la verdad todo es que no, no, um, me, mejor decidí um, eh, decirles ahí en clase, verdad, que necesitamos uh, pues tu colaboración con eso para que pues, um, pues sí, no, 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 no nos atrasemos, necesitamos eh, ponernos al día. Acuérdense que nos están ahí uh, monitoreando su, el progreso porque de eso se trata, ¿verdad? Que ustedes puedan demostrar de que en realidad ustedes están, eh, pues, tomando ventaja, ¿verdad? De, de este, um, de este oportunidad, esa oportunidad que se les está dando. Entonces, por eso es de que es importante que lo pongamos todo al día. Así que eh, les voy a pedir que ustedes puedan um, ponerse al día, ¿verdad? Eh, y, y así pues um, mañana puedo, voy a revisar nuevamente y espero que ya esté listo lo del midterm y lo de um, cómo se llama y lo de la dos porque acuérdense que han tenido bastante tiempo para terminarlo han tenido dos semanas entonces eh, ya debería pues, estar completo 
¿verdad? No sé si ustedes, han, alguien tiene alguna inquietud sobre eso, que por qué no lo pudo hacer. Yo con gusto le, le ayudo. Eh, no sé, algo, algo que tengan curiosidad. Que, que no han Yo entendido. tengo una duda con respecto al, a lo de la que estaba mala, la que no nos agarraba. Porque, o sea, como ahí se queda guardada la, la, la respuesta que uno le ha colocado, pero aún así no sé si se tendría que corregir automáticamente o hay que volverla a poner. Hay que Porque si es automático. Ajá. Hay que volver a ponerla. Ah. Ah, ajá, porque ahorita ahí me aparece como la respuesta, pero entonces... O oh, no sé si yo la estoy escribiendo mal, <ríe> porque no me la agarra. No me la agarra. A mí tampoco. A ver. Ajá. Yo la, la borré y la volví a poner y tampoco me, me la, o sea, siempre me la marcan mal. Sí, es que todavía tiene problemas la plataforma. Vale, déjenme revisar, porque si me dijeron que, que bueno. Ya, yo solo de muchas necesito ahorita voy a revisar. Okay. Pero además de ese, o sea, ese es solo un ejercicio. Eh, sí. En realidad, todo lo demás. Eh, pues creo que no. Sí, lo demás sí está bien. Uh -huh. Pero así que en teoría solamente es el único que debería estar um, incompleto, pero de ahí todo lo demás. Debería estar completo porque se supone que ya vimos toda la información, que no hay otros problemas, además de esos dos ejercicios. Entonces, ¿qué me dicen chicos? No sé, eh, ¿alguna preguntita? Uy, estoy viendo doble. Karina, estoy viendo doble. O son mis ojos. Y se está conectada desde el teléfono y también de la compu. Muy probablemente, sí. Cabal. Karina, eh, estamos aquí. Porque ni siquiera veo que tiene micrófono. Déjeme ver. It's real. Sí, tiene. Uh -huh. Bueno, ok. Bueno, uh, entonces, ¿qué les parece, chicos? Voy a volver a revisar mañana. Ya para mañana creen ustedes que podemos haber terminado eso porque les digo que sí, uh, faltan varios que no tienen el midterm y otros que no han terminado la unidad 2. Entonces, ¿creen ustedes que podemos eh, ya tenerlo listo para mañana? ¿Se podrían comprometer ahí a hacer eso? Yes, teacher. Sí. Ok. Ok, espero que sí. Um, sí, porque, como les digo, sí, hay, sí entiendo que, que, que están esos dos ejercicios, ¿verdad? Pero además de eso, deberíamos de, de poder avanzar con ello. Así que uh, voy a estar pendiente y si no, les voy a mandar un, un mensajito para recordarle, ¿verdad? Ok. Well, um, having said that, let's take attendance. Uh, Ani? Ani? No, Ani? Okay. What about Ana Maria? Ana Maria? Carolina. Present teacher. Welcome. Eh, Emily. Present teacher. Welcome, Emily. Hazel. Hazel. Okay. Uh, Joanna. Present teacher. Okay, welcome, Joanna. Eh, Thank you. Jorge. Present teacher. All right, welcome, Jorge. Karina. Mm -hmm. 
Karina. No. Teacher, Karina, tell a uh, write in the room. Present teacher, I can turn on my microphone. My computer is locked. I can't see. Ah, okay, okay. All right, no problem. Thank you. That's why, okay, no problem. Um, thank you, Karina. Carla? Present teacher. Welcome, Carla. Thank you, teacher. Santiago? Santiago? All right, uh, Linda. Present teacher. Welcome, Linda. And Marlene. Present teacher. Welcome, welcome, Marlene. And Nelson G. Present. Welcome, Nelson. Norma. Present teacher. Welcome, Norma. Olga. Present teacher. All right, welcome, Olga. Miguel. Present. Present. Okay, welcome, Miguel. Rocio. Present. Welcome, Rocio. Uh, Beatrice. Present. Welcome, Beatrice. Um, Suleyma. Present, teacher. Right, Suleyma. Tatiana. Present, teacher. Yeah, I Welcome, Suleyma. Okay. Tatiana. Present. Okay. Welcome, Tatiana. And uh, you. Nelson A. Nelson A. No. Uh, Omar. Omar. No, Omar. Okay. Julia Melgar. And Jose Rodrigo. Okay, I'm just going to repeat all that I didn't hear, which are An, An, Annie, Ana Maria. Present teacher, present teacher. Oh, okay. Welcome, present Annie. Teacher. Okay. So I am here too. Annie, Ana Maria, no, sorry. sorry perdón. Ana Maria. Present teacher. Ah, okay. Yes, I'm here. Uh, Hazel, Santiago, Nelson, Omar, Suleim, sorry, Nelson A, uh, Omar, Suleim, Amelgar, Rodrigo. Those are the people. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, so, um, We are going to start. Um, please tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. Can you see my PowerPoint? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Good. So, uh, oops. Okay. So, this is uh, basics of branding. That is our topic for today. Uh, your uh, facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. It's in three. It's May 24th, 2022. And it's class number 
I remember that we did an activity yesterday, and I thought that we're checking the answer today. So, um, what we're going to do right now is we're going to be checking the answers. Okay. Um, Look, do the first one, number one. Um, all right, you can open up your microphone and give me the answers. I didn't run. Fast enough to catch the bus. Sure? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, very good. I didn't run fast enough. Now, who can tell me why? Because fast is um and no fast. No, no. In, in adjective. Because fast is an adjective. Because in yeah. there are no nouns. So enough is very good. And remember, we put enough after adjectives. Uh -huh. All right, number. And sound good. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, exactly. Sometimes you have to rely on your ear too, right? So you, you it's like you say, oh, it, it sounds good, right? So yes, yeah. sometimes uh, just rely on your ear. It, it should, it should give you the correct answer. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, next one. She is. All enough. All enough. All enough. All enough. All enough. Good. Mm -hmm. Why? All is an adjective. All is like an adjective. All. Exactly. All is an adjective. You're absolutely mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, and so remember, after adjectives, we put um, the word enough. Mm -hmm. Number three, we have bought enough milk. Enough milk. Enough milk. Enough milk. Enough milk. Why? Mm -hmm. Because e milk is a noun and the and needs before the word enough. Exactly. Yes. Very good. Uh, so milk is a noun, and with nouns, nouns we put them after. The word enough. The first enough, and then the noun. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Uh, what about the next one? So she was mm, to lock the car. Rodent. Rodent enough. Rodent enough? Yeah. Very good. Why? Rodent. Prudent, prudent, prudent is an adjective. Right, prudent is an adjective, exactly. That's exactly right. Prudent is an adjective, very good. And we've always put uh, the adjective and then the word enough. Good, All right. Number five, he was? Was what? It was a magic stupid. Oh, wow. it was stupid. Very good. Stupid is objective. It is warm. Warm enough. Enough. Warm enough. Why? Warm. Um, why? Why? Yeah. Why is an adjective too? Right. Exactly. Because warm is also an adjective. Mm. Very good. Um. Good. Number seven. Have we got? Money enough. Money enough. Have we got? 
Enough money. Enough money. Very good. Enough money. Mm -hmm. Because money is a noun. Money is a noun. Yeah. Very good. Money is a noun. And uh, we always have the noun after enough. Number eight. Many tablets. Com sorry, tablet computers are. It's small, it's small enough. 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 It's small enough to put in your pocket. Why? It's small is an adjective. Because small is an adjective when you put, we put the adjective before the word enough. Okay. Uh, all right, next one. We haven't got enough shares. Enough shares. In your chairs. Enough chairs. 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 chairs are a noun. Exactly. Chair is a noun, and we put the noun after the word enough. Mm -hmm. Number 10. We haven't got blue enough. Enough. No. Enough. Enough. Blue. Enough. 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 Uh -huh. enough, 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 enough blue paint because blue paint is, is a noun. Very good. This one, this one was a tricky one, right? Yeah, because, mm -hmm. because because what? blue is also uh, because blue uh, could be also a uh, emotion. Uh, yeah, yes. the thing is that. Um, like uh, okay. well, blue is an adjective, right? So mm -hmm. we would think, oh, okay, yeah. so it has uh, it has to be at the beginning. But in reality, the blue is actually um, it's modifying the noun paint. So in reality, mm -hmm. we're, we're, we're the noun is, is the word paint. Okay, and blue is just um, giving us an, uh, a, a a description of the type of paint. Mm -hmm. So in reality, uh, what we have to pay attention to here is the noun paint. That's why we say enough blue paint. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. How did you do with this one? Did we understand it? Yeah, we understood it or not? Yes. Yes, we yes. understood. Yeah. We understood. And I have enough blue paint. Yes, I have enough blue paint. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Um, let me clear that. Okay. So yesterday we finished, we were doing this, the uh, remember uh, the, the group discussion about um, the service, the service or product that you use every week. Do you remember this? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Did we finish? Yes. 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 Everybody. Yes. Yes, did you? Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right. In that case, what we're going to do is we're going to present. We're going to start presenting. So, um, give me a moment. Okay. Um, I believe so maybe in the capturas group number one in, in room number one is Carla and Norma okay teacher yes okay. no Ana Maria Me? Um, so Carla, Norma, and Ana Maria. Yes. Okay. 
Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, I'm trying to share my screen. <laughs> All right, we're waiting for you guys. Yes, um, give me a moment. I try to share with the screen. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I can feature um, post disabled participant screen share. Sorry. Okay, there you go. You should be able to now. Okay. Ready when you are. Oh, no, Maria, oh, yeah, yeah, I'm going to start. Yes. Okay. Um, good evening, everybody. The product that we showed yesterday uh, was a Colgate toothpaste. As we know, this is a daily use product. And why we choose that product? First of all, because um, we know that we consider that, that this company has created a very good image in our life. For example, when we think in, in Colgate, um, immediately we think in our family and the healthy of our family. So we choose that. Uh, that product. Uh, no, so as uh, well, um, you can find on a different presentation about the product. We can find a different presentation. Um, this is a very important product for the person now healthy and the special for our mouth. And also, we can find a different. Uh, type of product like uh, well, you can bo buy a mold wash to brush and dental flash and also um, another uh, my classmate is going to share with you uh, about the price <laughs> I don't know. The price, uh, the price of this product are accessible and the quality is so good for the personal healthy. They have some products with low price, depending depending of the presentation you want. Okay, about the place, um, this product is distributed in supermarket, gas station pharmacies and stores and is in a great demand due to uh, because it's a daily use um, about promotions it has different promotion accessible uh, to its customers for example two products for the price of one or a great discount advertisement on social media tv and radio for this reason uh, we consider this Brand is one of the most um, important in the market right now. And that's it, teacher. Did you answer all the questions? Um, yes, um, I think um, it's only for one guy. No, um, implement the questions exactly. 
Sorry, I didn't understand. Could you repeat that question, that, that your answer again? I think it was only for a guy, right? Oh, okay, okay. All right, so you didn't really answer all the questions. Okay, all right. Okay, thank you very much. Trying to pause. Very good. Okay, let's go on to group number two. I have Miguel, Olga, and Tatiana. Okay, go ahead. Okay, uh, we product uh, the Colgate Palm Oliva. You get to give the product a new brand name. What name do you choose? Colgate what? Colgate Max White. What does the product? Colgate is a registered trademark of the use company. Colgate Palmolive of Anchor product. Sushi. Pasty. The brushes. Mold washing flow. How much do The product cost Colgate is around the three dollar. Three dollar uh, eighteen cents in all the supermarket and convenience store. Uh, will you use any special price strategies? Uh, for example, if you buy uh, the Max Y, you will have a free dental floss. And the other question uh, is, if so, which strategies and why? Uh, we choose a discount, uh, for example, and the other strategy is the second product at half half price. Uh, why? Because this is a product so necessary for the cleaning of the teeth and good breath. And we want to increase sales because that is important for the for the business. Uh, the other question. Uh, where will you see your product, uh, retail stores, online, etc.? Uh, we choose by supermarket, online, any store in your neighborhood. You will find the the Max Y uh, the Max Y by Colgate. Okay, about the question number six. We choose the the option next: advertising by marketing promotion price, BC Street Corner, in the cashier, and by TV. About the question number seven: How will you advertise uh, the product by TV and radio, social media? in the newspapers. And the last question, we choose uh, the reason is all people under 12 years old. And only that. Finished picture. Okay. All right. Sorry, guys. I had lost my, my microphone. 
<laughs> okay, excellent. Very good. Bravo. Excellent. Okay, Thank before you. before we continue, though, uh, remember that we are um, talking about these products that even though they are very common for us in, um, you know, in our everyday language, and we call them by a certain name. But remember, in English, it's different. We do not, uh, in English, we don't say colgate. How do you pronounce that in English? Colgate. Colgate, very good, exactly. So remember that brand names are different um, in, in different languages, right? Okay. Um, for example, um, I don't know, words like, um, oh, I can't think of something right now. Um, they say, for example, um, in, in Spanish, you say Nivea. But in English, it's. An area? No, teacher. No? Nivea. Nivea. Nibia. 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 Yeah. 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 Exactly. In Spanish, you say, Nick Vaporu. What is it? Vaporu. Piense, piense como, como se escribe. Vaporu. Vaporu. Very close. Very close. Yeah. Yeah. Vapor. Vapor rub. Vapor. Vapor rub. Vapor rub. Okay. So uh, things that you have to take into consideration, right? That it's not a big vaporu, it's Vix vapor rub. And this, this same thing goes with, with this, in this case, the, um, the colgate, right? The colgate, that's fine in, in Spanish, but because we're talking about this product in English, it would be? Colgate. Colgate, exactly. Okay, so just keep that in mind. All right. So very good, excellent. Okay, uh, next we have Emily, Jorge, and Beatriz. Jorge, are you going to present your screen? Sorry, I didn't hear. Could you see the presentation? No, yet. The connection is it's so bad, but I'm trying to connect again. Could you see the presentation? Yes. Thank Perfect. you, Jorge. Okay. So um, we decide the question number one says, uh, you get to hear the name, what name do you choose? We invent our name, we invent the name of our product. In this, as you can see in the picture, a uh, shampoo. That is, the name is Clean Beauty Hair. And answer the second question, what does your product do? This shampoo not only provides the cleaning of the scalp skin and hair and its primary, as its primary function, but in addition, also serves to condition in beauty our hair. Number three is how much does your product cost? We decide a price that we consider that is good for um, all the people to get it, and it is five dollars per unit. Ah, gracias. 
for, for the number number four, uh, we choose like a special price strategies, take one and take the second one in a half of price. Uh, get one and get a small size shampoo for free. Accounts that we will offer discount for orders that have higher quantity of our shampoo because it's because uh, other uh, companies that interested in, in our product and also gives free samples for people to know the shampoo and know the, the fish that, that this kind of product. For the number five, uh, where will you sell your product? It will be in the national and international supermarket main franchise, and we will be supplying of membership, like warehouse, companies, stores, world stores. And the number six, uh, where will you present your product catch the eye of your target customers? Uh, we choose like top shelf and in the shelves near to the entrance in the local store. That's it. That's it. That's the whole presentation. Yes. No. Uh, continuing. Oh, okay. My classmate. Okay. How will you advertise the product by social media posts? Facebook and introductory offers, portals, and giveaways. Who is your target customer? This product is for both women and men, but mainly this product is designed for women because women want to look pretty. And it's also targeted those customers who have low income. And that's it. No, yes, no, yes. Very good, excellent, bravo. Okay, um, just be, just remember it's franchise. Fran franchise. Franchise. Yes. Franchise. Yes. Mm -hmm. Franchise. Okay, thank you. What is franchise in Spanish? Franquicia. Franquicia. Very good. Mm -hmm. Fran franchise. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent, thank you. All right, let's uh, see who's next. Um, we have... Annie, uh, group number four, Annie, Nelson G and Rocio. Yes, teacher. Uh, Joanna will share the screen. The, okay, Charles, the let me. Yeah, okay. Charles, let me um, share my screen now. And we're going to mm. start. Okay, good evening, everyone. Uh, we we are going to talk about our product. Um, we chose this product, uh, Rexona Clinical, because we consider it's important for personal care. And well, the first question uh, is, you get to give the product a new brand name. What name do you choose? We chose for fresh. And the number four at the end of this world, fresh means, uh, F for fragrance, because it has a lovely smell. Uh, fresh, because you can feel you without sweat. And functional, because it, it works uh, very good. And forever, because it expertly fights moisture for 96 hours. And then 
what does the product do? Yeah. For fresh provides our best protection against excessive sweating. The innovative formula creates a clever micro shield that expertly fights moisture for 96 hours, making this anti, anti and stronger versus a basic anti -resistant. Nelson, you are going to talk about the price. Hello. Uh, and most do is your product cost, a special price uh, to, to fishing and promotion price, a uh, three fishing price according to presentation. Uh, will you say any special prices, strategies, campus, uh, campus events, etc. Is a sweet strategy and we. Presentation of the printing is a marketing strategy you say by business uh, to attract customer to an end product or service by offering a lower price during do during series initial of offering. The lower price help a new product or service penetrate the market and attract customer away from competitors. Placement. Where will you sell your product? Retail, stores, online, etc. For phrase, it's a valuable at different points of sales, such as supermarkets, from which this product will be sold. It is also available on, in online stores. Where will you position your product to? Cash the age of your target customer, talk chairs, base your screen corner, etc. It is positioned and the gondola points where there is more influx of, of people using advertising that attracts attracts attention in strategic areas. Okay, we talk about promotion. Uh, how will you advertise a product? Uh, we will advertise at story selling, storytelling. That is a tool that consists of telling a story that is attractive to your customers and motivates them to take initiative, like uh, Rexona do with all the advertising on TV. How will you advertise a product uh, for cross-selling? When it comes to knowing how to sell a product, cross-selling is a very interesting sales strategy. It consists in offering a product or service that is related to the one uh, the potential customer needs. Uh, for example, if a customer buys a toothbrush, a complementary product that could be offered is a toothpaste. And how will you advertise the product? For a sponsor uh, of sporting events, when uh, we will be in racing events, in favor of foundation or in support of health. Sponsoring water bottles or t-shirts for uh, the participants. Uh, who is your target customer? Uh, gentlemen and ladies over 14 years old, especially people who practice sport or some type of physical activity. And that's all the presentation teacher. Thank you. All right, very Thank good, you. excellent. Thank you, very good. Okay, just some words I need you to practice with me. Fragrance. 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 Very good. Okay. Um, next we have a uh, price. 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 Okay. Next word, um, we have strategic. You see that? Strategic. 
Everybody, strategic. 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 Good. All right. Strategic. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Excellent. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's go on to the next group. Uh, the next group and last group is Carolina, Hazel, Karina, and Marlene. Um, ready? Um, Karina, eh, podría poner las primeras páginas, la voy a explicar yo, teacher, le tocaba a Hazel, pero Hazel se desconectó, no está conectada, entonces voy a leer yo la parte de ella. Ok. Okay, ready when you are. Please, las primeras páginas. Thank you. Llevarlo para allá. Hacer la amabilidad de llevarme un reto para allá. Apague el micrófono, Nelson. Ok. Colgate eh, eh, Marketing Mix Plan. Carolina, Colgate. The name of the, of the brand? What is the name of the brand? Colgate. 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 Yes, very good. Okay. Uh -huh. Continue. Okay. okay. Uh, a marketing mix plan. Uh, product. Um, Colgate Luminous White Product. What does Colgate Luminous Play what, White do? Uh, benefits ensuring a bright smile and mode that is always fresh. Help preserve natural white tea. Colgate Luminous White Advanced Spirit to paste, uh, worse beyond the surface uh, for a whiter smile in just three days. Uh, benefits, the exclusive formula uh, with hydrogen peroxide, a whiter smile in just three, three days with the same technology used by dentists, Colgate Luminous Whites to paste uh, help keep the natural white. Uh, Colgate Luminous White Instant Toothpaste help keep the natural white. The benefit uh, instantly whiter smile and optical brightness.